Hi everyone, back again with an Alcrate unboxing. This is the June box. I'm just gonna jump right in. <laughs> this actually came over the weekend, so it, they have, I feel like they've been coming earlier each month. Um, I think it's, uh, if the fates allow, it doesn't actually say on here. It might say somewhere else. Actually, it should say on a spoiler card. I'm trying not to look at it. Mm. Yeah, well, that's the thing. Okay, first item right on top is... The sea does not like to be restrained. I'm guessing that's Percy Jackson. It's like a little navy bag that just fell out. And that's what it looks like. Yep, the sea does not like to be restrained. And it is a little rope cord necklace. And inspired by the Percy Jackson series, this enamel pendant necklace references our favorite demigod duo, Percy and Annabeth. You will find Percy's sword, Riptide on one side, and Athena's owl on the other. Designed with love by at Keeley Studios. That's cute. I don't know if I'll actually wear that. I do like Percy Jackson, but I'm kind of basic with my necklaces. Next item is this. This was the item I was most excited about. It because it's for the Song of Achilles, and I loved that book. Hmm. I wonder. Let's see what this looks like. So, it is a hand mirror. The Song of Achilles hand mirror reflect on the tale of Achilles and Pericles. Patrocles. I said that wrong. Patrocles with the Song of Achilles inspired hand mirror. For those who see the hopeless romantic in themselves, this mirror features beautiful artwork and a quote from the story that truly represents the love displayed between Achilles and Patrocles to the very end. Artwork created with love by at Vitkovskaya underscore art. Let's go put it there so you can see it. And I'm going to, it says, I would know him in death at the end of the world. And it's, I'm trying to do it like that. It's kind of hard to tell, honestly, but it's just a little hand mirror. And there's the back. It's very reflective. But that's cute. I don't know. I just have to probably set this on my shelf because I'd be afraid to break it. So I wouldn't take it anywhere. Okay, next item. Keep your wooden tables and halls safe from the wayward burns with this ceramic trivet. Inspired by our favorite tales from Norse mythology, this trivet features a quote by Neil Gaiman and has lovingly illustrated has been lovingly illustrated by at Pauhami. I'm guessing this is like an oversized a trivet, like an oversized um, coaster. <laughs> that's what. That's, yeah, that's really what it reminds me of. The quote is, that's the joy of myths. Read the stories and make them your own. Neil Gaiman. Yeah, I guess that's supposed to be Frenrir. Um, is that supposed to be Slep Slepnir? I can't, I can never say it right. Um, Odin's Crow? Raven? I can't remember them all. Um, and then, of course, the world snake. Um, I thought that was chipped at first, but that's actually just part of the design. Um, 
I'm drawing a blank on the name of the world snake. But then I'm back just all crazy. And it's ceramic. The next and what I think. Well, no, there's one more after this. Inspired by the Scorpio races by Maggie Steve Otter. Designed with love by at Janine Kaur and Divine Literary. From the sea to the sea. A picnic blanket. Okay, it's like it's like the like rough canvasy material. So that's what that looks like. And then, then so you can see who it's made by. And it's literally like a little carrying thing. And then it folds out to be just this design. That's neat. A little picnic blanket. This would come in handy for if I finally get to go camping this year. It's been a while. And then for our treasured tomes pin, it is the Raven Cycle. Let's open this. Here we go. That's kind of neat. Honestly, it reminds me more of Ravenclaw because of the blue. And then you open it. That is a very loose hinge. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Designed by at no one designs. It's, you can kind of see it. It's not the best picture. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, and then for the book. If the fates allow was the theme. There's the book in the bottom. If the fates allow. Okay. And the book is Threads That Bind. I really like when they do sprayed edges. No sprayed edges for this. But the newest thing they did was the see-through designed cover. So that's kind of neat. Again, so reflective. You can see everything. And then fill your heart and keep going anyway. Oh, fill your... I said that totally wrong. Fill, fill your fear and keep going anyway. Okay, that, that makes more sense. But then when you take this cover off, like I said, it's got more designs right there. You get this, which is beautiful. Looks so much better than the original. So pretty. Then signed by the author, an inbound author letter. Okay, so the end pages are actually more foil. That's really neat. I don't think I've seen this in a book before. It's the same on both sides, but very cool. And I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be some artwork in the book. Well, no, maybe that's from a different book that I'm expecting to come. It does, it's like three parts for this. Huh. I kind of hope to get to this soon because I've heard good things. Um, and I do love anything that has to do with gods and mythology. And I think that's kind of what this is supposed to be. Kind of. Kind of reminds me of the the three fates I've got paper worms all over the place um I mean I'm satisfied with the box I kind of I mean I don't know what I'm gonna do with this I've never read the raven cycle <laughs> the song of Achilles I love but it's a hand mirror so I'm not sure what to do with that and I'll probably get use out of this but I've also never read the Scorpio races. That's actually the only thing in this whole box that I have not even heard of. Get, uh, I have no idea. Who knows? Ow. But yeah, if I'm pretty sure it shows the original art in here. It should. Yeah. 
I really prefer this over the original art. It is very pretty. Um, and then the spoiler card for next month basically just says what the theme is. And the theme for next month is Break the Curse. And then for the sneak peek for next month, every July box will include an exclusive item designed by at Angai Anguin. Anguin? I cannot say that last name. Nugin? An Nugin? Art. <laughs> if you are already a subscriber, your account will automatically renew. I do kind of like her art on here. It's very cute. But there's the card. And that's the what I was having trouble pronouncing. So <laughs> anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you like, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks and see you next time.